Chango a la bio yo e. A la bio yo e. Bamba o que te ile cabo. Chango a la bio yo e. A la bio yo e. Bamba o que te ile cabo. Chango a la bio yo e, a la bio yo e, bamba o que te ile cabo. Chango a la bio yo e, a la bio yo e, bamba o que te ile cabo. Chango a la bio yo e, a la bio yo e, bamba o que te ile cabo. Hello, my name is Rafael Saldivar. I'm a Juno nominee Cuban pianist and composer. I'm here and I'm performing a piece called Chango that features Latin Grammy Award winner Mr. Amado Deo Garcia's on percussions and vocals. This song is going to be part of my next CD record, which is going to be out this summer, this 2021 summer. <clears throat> but I am really happy because now I'm sharing with you this book here called Travels in Cuba. This is a book written by Marilui Guy and David Hommel, and it's basically a story for children, but also uh, this book shows a very realistic way of writing about the culture of Cuba and the way people um, had to deal with day-to-day -day life in Cuba. <clears throat> so um, the funny thing is that I am part of the book too. I am on the book on page uh, 116 and 117 on chapter 8. The title of the chapter is, is A Peak on a Bike. This is a really funny title. But anyway, um, the story happens between a family traveling in Cuba and a person that lives in Cuba. The person is called Dolores and her mother too. So basically the story goes like that. From Canada, she asked us. We nodded. I have a cousin in Canada, Montreal. Do you know Rafael Saldivar? At least this time he's in Vancouver, in the other side of the continent. I am sorry, we don't, my mother told her. Montreal is a big city. Like Vinales. Imagine thinking that Vinales was a big city. I wondered if people in Cuba ever traveled in their own country. Had she even been to Havana? Wait a minute, Rafael Saldivar, my father asked her, isn't the piano player? I saw him at the jazz festival. Si, si, Dolores' mother say, he's my cousin. He is a fantastic musician, my father told her. I have one of his records. She and Dolores smiled proudly. In the summer, he plays in the park near where we live. I will tell him that I meet you. Dolores and Marisa, her mother, say. So this is a really funny story that I recommend to you. And um, please don't hesitate to provide you with the book. Once again, the book is called Travels in Cuba 
Byte, Marie-Louise Guy and David Hommel. <laughs> 